and especially my edges like that's how I found this recent hack I've been using for my edges like once again you're welcome you're welcome okay like <laughs> It's Nay Rose here and I'm back with another video for you guys and as I told you guys we're about to get into my favorite hair products for my colored hair now while I was picking out like my top products I noticed that none of my products are really like for color treated hair or anything like that like when I go shopping for my hair products I don't really look for that I really don't know why but most of the products that I use, I gear towards sulfate free, paraben free, um, no mineral oils, no petrolatum, all that type of stuff is what I look for when I get my products. So that actually is what most of my products consist of. Um, I have about eight, I'm saying about eight, like I didn't already count. I knew, I knew. I have eight products to show you guys that I picked out. Now if I was to go through and pick like everything that I like, we will be sitting here all day. So I try to pick out like the main ones that I use like the most. So we're just gonna get right into it. We're gonna start off with the, the brand that I have the most, which is Aunt Jackie's. Um, even before I became a brand ambassador for them, I used Aunt Jackie's stuff because like I said, I care more about what's in the products and their stuff is really, really good for your hair. Like their products have no sulfates, no parabens, no mineral oils and no petrolatum in it. So I know when I'm using this stuff, you know, it's helping my hair versus damaging it. So we'll just start off with this detangler. This is my favorite detangler, oh my gosh. And yes, I've tried other brands. Of course I use all brands, but this detangler is like so bomb. The slip with this detangler is so, so, so good. And also it can be used as a leave-in. So that's why I like using this as well. Um, My favorite, ooh, y'all, Curl Lala. Okay, so my favorite, product for like twist outs or braid outs or flat twists. First of all, it smells so freaking good. Like, oh, <laughs> I just got out my look. Oops. But Curl La La smells so good. Oh my gosh, it smells amazing. And it leaves your hair just super, super soft. It's basically a moisturizing, curling, and defining custard. And it, it just leaves my hair super, super moisturized. I never have to refresh my hair the next day when I use this. Ooh, um, next we will go into, oh my gosh, I love Talia Wajid, or I don't know how you pronounce it, but y'all know what I'm talking about. Um, this is the Curl Activator and Defining Cream. Oh my gosh, this stuff, First of all, this smells good as well. I always go for smells, you guys. I really, really like when stuff smells good. That's why like, I always get compliments. Like, I'm not even trying to like boost or anything, but I really do be getting compliments on how my hair smells. This, as you can see, it says it has bamboo, biotin, and basil in it. Um, it just keeps my hair really, really shiny, along with um, one of my other products that I had to show you guys, which is by the same brand and it is the curly curl cream i like this one as well it adds shine to my curls i actually used a little bit of this mixed in with something else that i'm gonna show you guys in one minute today on my hair but yeah so this curly curl cream yeah curly curl cream um i put these on my little curlies <laughs> and i love the consistency of this stuff there's something about the consistency that just has me like it's like uh it's so it's like satisfying like it's like a sticky, but not like a bad sticky. I don't know how to describe it, but this will have your hair looking right. But I usually don't use it for like wash and goes, only because this is one of those things that I feel like you just use it for like touch ups or I guess like exaggerate certain parts of your hair. This stuff, okay, this is Eden Body Works and it is there. Ooh, it's a lot of stuff written on here. Okay, hydrate and soothe butter for hair and body. This is something that I recently got. I'm gonna have to stack up on this stuff because this stuff is the bomb. Like I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. And then it's for hair and body and it works equally as good in both. Like this is actually what I have in my hair right now mixed in with what I showed you guys a minute ago, the curl cream. But it's mainly just this. Like, like I said, I only use this for like little stuff. So I just redefine like curls like this and the side of it with this, but everything else in my hair is just this. Just this, and it's not even a definer. 
like it's a butter so it's not even like a it's not even for like defining your curls but it actually made them pop even more so I really like that I'm keeping this definitely in my little hair stash so thank me later you guys you're welcome okay last two products um, one is this Aunt Jackie's In Control. Oh my gosh, this is like my favorite deep conditioner. You can use it as a deep conditioner or a co-wash. Um, it's up to you, so I like that. It's kind of like a two-in-one type of thing. And it's super, super soft. Like it leaves your curls just so soft. And um, actually like it works good to detangle. Like while I'm deep conditioning, when I like brush it through with my Demon brush, it actually goes through really, really smooth. Like I said, it like softens your curls. So I really, really like this stuff. And y'all know I've been using this. Like, if you go back to one of my older videos. So yeah, there's really not much to it. I just really like this deep conditioner. Um, and then the last thing. Oh wait, I'm tripping. This is not the last one. I got one more after this. But this is something a little bit different than like the other types of products. This is a mousse that I really, really like to use. This is the Cream of Nature mousse. And it's from their Argan Oil line. So I originally picked this up because I was doing like a lot of slick backs like last week. And if you look on my Instagram, you know I've been doing like the slick backs with the added weave. So I needed something to kind of like set it in place. So I was at the beauty supply store and I was like, okay, let me just grab a mousse and go. Come to find out, like I've been sleep on this mousse the whole time because it's really been working wonders for my hair. Like it really, really set it in place. Like, you know, you just kind of use something just to use it for the moment. Yeah, it was supposed to be like one of those type of situations, but I feel like this is about to be like my go-to mousse. That sleek back stayed all day, you guys. Like, it didn't even make it crunchy either. Like, it just set it in place, and especially my edges. Like, that's how I found this recent hack I've been using for my edges. Like, if you do your edges right, with whatever products you use, and you put some of this on top of it, y'all, like, once again, you're welcome. You're welcome. Okay, like, let me stop because I can go on all day about these products, but okay, we're going to move on to my last product, which is this Moroccan Oil Curl Defining Cream. Oh my gosh, you guys, this stuff is so good. And honestly, this one isn't even up the alley of, oh, no sulfates, no parabens, no mineral oils, like all that stuff. This isn't one of those little extra healthy hair products. Nah, this is just a really good bomb product. Like, y'all know them products that's just like, I don't even care. Cause my results though. But see, the other stuff is more of like my everyday type of stuff since I know it's doing really good stuff to my hair, especially since my hair is colored. This, I don't know, but I know it looks good, okay? One thing about this product is that it's expensive. As you can see, I got me a little travel size, little mini one because the eight ounce one, which is considered their full size one, is like $34, y'all. I mean, I don't know if that's expensive to y'all. To me, for one product, $34, eh, eh. When I run out, I run out. When there's no more, on to the next. I have other options. I can use a replacement. But now y'all, like, I let a few months go by after like I ran out the first time and then I was like, dang, I kind of missed that product. And you know, like when you start thinking about a product, like that really means that you really don't want to go without it. And I was just thinking about that product like, dang, like, my curls really used to be popping with that part. So I went back and bought me a little mini one. I think this one was like $15 for a 2.5 ounce, so. So yeah, that was the last thing out of my little bunch of favorite products that I use on my colored hair. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.